Good morning, you guys. So it's Friday, and this morning I was having the hardest time picking out an outfit. Just I feel like I've worn everything multiple times already, so I feel like I need to go shopping. So I was getting mad because I couldn't find an outfit, and I just ended up wearing my school shirt. I was just like, F it, you know? But I didn't even tell you guys, those two shirts that I had gotten at Target, I did try them on in the fitting room, and I thought they looked okay. But then when I came home and I actually wanted to wear one with like my work pants, like my slacks or whatever, they just did not look good with them. Because you know how the side like had the little scrunchy part or whatever, like going down the sides? It was just too much and they were maternity. So it was like, you know, you, it was a lot of extra fabric. So it just didn't look good with my work pants. So I just ended up taking them back and I still have to find some work shirts, but I was on Forever 21 online. And they have a lot of cute stuff. A lot of it is like long sleeve and stuff, which sucks because it's still it still feels like summer here in Southern California. So, I mean, I don't know if I should just wait and order that stuff later or what. But I think that's what I'm going to do. And right now I'm just having a bagel with some cream cheese. So, I just did the No Mirror Makeup Challenge and check out... I don't know if you guys can see my eyeliner. It's pretty crazy. Ah, hair stuck. My glasses ripped out of hair. But yeah, so I just did the challenge and it was really fun. But I, I wanted to say because I'm talking to Diane. I mentioned her before. She like I started talking to her because of, she like found me on YouTube and now I consider her like a really good friend even though I've never met her, but you guys know what I mean. So she was just telling me how she's looking forward to this weekend's vlog. And I just wanted to quickly say like a thank you to you guys because I didn't know if you guys were going to be interested in my vlogs, you know, like when I posted my first one. I didn't know how you guys were going to like not react, but like take to them. I don't know if you're going to watch them or like them or maybe you didn't even want to see vlogs, you know, you just want beauty videos. But I'm getting really positive feedback from, I've been posting for like about a month now or a little over a month. And... It's just like all positive feedback, so I just wanted to say thank you to you guys for, you know, be, like being so supportive with my vlogs and all my videos, not even just my vlogs, like all of my videos, you guys are so supportive and I just love that, like I love you guys, you guys are awesome, so I just wanted to say thank you because I was nervous about posting them, but you guys love them and I love vlogging and, and I like love talking to you guys besides just, you know, on the beauty side, I love doing both, you know, like I even feel like vlogging more now, like just not on the daily because I'm kind of boring a lot of the days because I just work and then I come home and I'm tired. So I don't I don't see it being a daily thing, but maybe like more than just once a week, you know. So let me know if you'd be interested in that because, you know, I'm getting such positive feedback that I want to post more for you guys. I want to post what you guys want to watch, you know. So let me know also if you have any beauty requests, like for any beauty videos. Um, I know I have more tutorials that I want to post with my Lorac Pro palette because I'm getting a lot of you guys letting me know that you've bought it and that you love my tutorials. So I'm so happy to hear that and I'm happy to hear that you guys love the palette because I love that palette. But yeah, so that's all I wanted to say. So I'm hanging out with Norma. She ended up coming over and we had some food and we just did our nails. Hi. But I just ended up going with like a pink and then some glitter. Can I see the heart? That does look good. Okay guys, so it's like, what time is it? It's 6.30, I've been up since like 4.40 and I'm headed to Fresno to pick up my cousin. I'm with her boyfriend right now in um, the truck and she's moving back down to Southern California because she's living in Fresno right now. So we're gonna go pick her up and I'm just kind of coming to like, kind of drive back with her because she's bringing, like we have the truck to carry all her stuff and then she's gonna drive down with her car but she's never done like that five hour drive on her own. I have, cause I'm a pro. But <laughs> um, she's never done that five drive, that five hour drive on her own. So she didn't want to drive it on her own cause he's gonna come back in this truck and we're gonna come back in her car. So that's all I'm gonna do today is just be on the road all day. I think we're gonna get there, pick her up, probably grab some lunch and then drive back. So that's what I'm gonna do today. So we're just leaving my cousin's house and look at the car, it is like jam packed and the truck. So we just got here real quick, packed everything up 
and we're leaving now I think we're gonna go get something to eat but I'm super tired and something really embarrassing happened to me earlier but I'm not sure if I want to tell you guys yet <laughs> whatever you guys my, my cousin just closed the window on my hand I had like my fingers sticking out because you know my arm is like resting and she just told look at that stupid ass <laughs> hey guys so we're about to go to Target and I'm pretty tired last night we got home like around 8 and I just like knocked out as soon as I got home I put my PJs on and I went to bed because I was just tired from being on the road all day and I did not sleep at all. At first, I didn't want to sleep because it's like a five hour car trip. And at first, I didn't want to sleep because I was with my cousin's boyfriend. And I don't want to be right there like with my mouth all open like asleep. And then when I was with my cousin, she was like, you can't go to sleep. So she, I only knocked out for like maybe a total of 20 minutes yesterday while we were on the road. So I was tired. And then today, I woke up early. I thought I was going to sleep until late, but I ended up waking up like at 8 or something. So I'm getting sleepy again and I still have to do laundry and just cleaning to do like my room and I have to go to Target right now because I need like shampoo and stuff like that. So that's what we're gonna go do. So we just got to Target and I went to go look for my coupons and I forgot them, I'm so mad. Stop looking at me because it's your fault. We ended up at Walmart since Target was a fail. This is where I buy my nail polishes. But then they also have like a lot of brands of makeup that I've never, well I've heard of them because I see them here so I have heard of them but you guys know what I mean. They also have like a bunch of lashes over there but yeah so I've found a lot of good products that I like from here and then they also have NYX so you guys can see this is where I find a lot of that stuff that you, I can't really tell you guys where to go buy because I found it here you know. Oh, check out my dad. What are you I'm eating? Get, I'm getting ready to eat some coconut cake. <laughs> Who's that? Was, it was a birthday cake for my sister. Oh. And this is my portion of the that's, cake. That's his that's slice. My, yeah. That's their slice. That's my slice right there. <laughs> but we just got home. I'm going to show you guys what I bought. So from Walmart, I got shampoo. I also got this one because it's like it smells really minty and I feel like that's going to feel amazing on my scalp. So I got that, and then I got, look at, I didn't know they started making these in the big size, or like the big bottles, but I just got the conditioner, some nail polish remover, because I was already out. Got a stain on my comforter. And then I got two polishes at that little polish place, and you guys, I don't know if you saw the sign, but these are a dollar each, like the NYX, Santee, they also have clean colors, and Italia, but I got, this one is called Muted Lavender. And then this just dark gray. And then this one is called frosty gray, but it's not frosty. It's just like a cream color. Okay, guys, it's time to get serious. Like, I need to clean my room. I still have stuff over here for my Charlotte Russe haul. I have a mess everywhere. And then I have this that's supposed to be my favorites that I want to film tomorrow. Ugh. And then I'm still doing laundry. I'm so lazy. So we just took my sister's camera right now, and we're about to dance for you guys. Because, you know, you always got to have a clip on me. So when you make your way across the room, I can only assume that me and you are going home tonight. Bye guys. So I'm responding to comments on my new video and I'm getting, like on my tutorial that I posted, I'm getting such good feedback. And a lot of you guys love this palette and are loving my tutorials. So I'm just going to keep posting different looks with it because it's all that I've pretty much been using. I mean I do and I will post with other eyeshadows and stuff like that. but. A lot of you guys want to see the Lorac Pro palette and like I said um, a few days ago I want to post what you guys want to watch so I'm pretty much gonna call it a blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna call it a vlog um, I think we're just gonna watch a movie the sitter and we just had dinner so yeah but I hope you guys enjoyed the video and let me know if you want to start seeing more vlogs I'm thinking twice a week um, would be good or something I don't know if you guys want to see that so let me know and I will talk to you guys later <laughs>